Coach, you got a tough one on the road in Manhattan this weekend. How has your team responded so far to bouncing back after a tough one in Stillwater? They've been good. I think they understand how many mistakes were made and, and that if we'll play our game one of these games, mm -hmm. we'll, we'll have a chance to, to really be a, a good football team. So they're working hard. I know we have a great challenge this week and have stepped up. In a typical K-State fashion, not a lot of mistakes, not a lot of penalties. They do like to control possession. What do you do to disrupt that? Just try to get them off schedule. And, and they're tough because, like you said, they don't make mistakes. They make you earn everything on offense. And, and then defensively, they're going to try to pound you and take what you give them. So it, it's a very well-coached team, and, and we have to match their execution. You really found success against the Cowboys with a balance, running the ball and then stretching the field. How – how important has that development been, and how much have you liked being able to kind of be able to balance it more so? It's been good. We need to improve even more so in, in both areas, mm -hmm. but um, I, I think our O-line has progressed nicely, and the running backs are doing a great job, so that's, that's opened up some other things. Special teams really could play a key factor this week, especially with the explosiveness of Tyler Lockett, but then we saw Jakeem Grant explode against the Cowboys. X factor? We'll see. Both those guys are tremendous players, and so um, the coverage units better be on high alert this week. Lastly, what's going what's to be the key factor? We can say penalties. We can say don't turn over the ball. In your mind, though, what's the key factor? I think that's it. Uh, we've turned the ball over so much this year, um, and, and just given the opponent great field position, we can't continue to do that if, if we don't have any more success.